Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Victoria 2, Episode 5. My name is Christopher Smith, and welcome back. So in the last episode, we declared war on Oman and Ethiopia, and pretty much got small chunks of Africa. Which is probably a good thing because we needed to get some small chunks of Africa. Let me just do this real quick. So for this episode, um, I'm going to rip my... Um, Infamy to reduce down to rare 15, and I'm going to try and see if I can either fully annex either Hejaz, or Yemen, or what? when do- Oh, I can declare war again? Let's see, Conquest? No, I can't because they still have this. Let's see, how much does Lumanu have? Uh, Kenya, Zanzibar, well... And I don't want to do Egypt because... I don't know, I just have a weird, weird, weird feeling about them. Let's see here. Spain is neutral. Italy is neutral. Let's see. Spanish influence is 16. The US influence is 28. Uh, I just feel like if I invade Egypt right now, it might um, harm my bottom line. Even though the Sinai Peninsula is very, very tempting. Like, very tempting. Let's see, Jazz has wheat, lamb, lamb. You have wheat, fish, opium, more opium. Eh. It'd be kind of cool to get into the that kind of market. How about Abu Dhabi? Uh, can I... Uh, hold on. Justify war. Establish protectorate. Huh. And what do you have? Wheat. 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 More wheat. But do you have the population to justify anything? No. Actually, you pretty got zilch stuff. So, yeah. I'm just going to play along. Okay. Okay, got the joint stock company. Nice, nice. Okay, after I get Iron Railroad, I'm gonna work on machine guns so I can. Actually, no, I'm gonna get do a little bit of the military stuff first. So pluralism. Let's do this one. Okay, do I actually do I have enough money for um, a naval base yet? Nope. Hold on, army professionalism. Okay. And uh, how much do I need for that? I'm gonna need 18,000 gold. Oh, I can do another reform. Um, suffrage movement. So, way to universal. There we go. I might actually end up getting over a million people by the end of all this. That'd be kind of sweet. But right now, my my primary thing is to get my infamy down to a lot lower. I would sign a Geneva Convention, but I'm going to hold off on that until I can basically make sure I can... I think I might do it once I get down to 16 infamy, because, like I said, knowing how the infamy system works, I can get it on the very first day, and on some occasions, I may not even get it at all. Okay, I got Army Professionalism. Actually, hold on. Damn it! God, invading Australia would be kind of very trolly. Uh, you're allied in Venezuela. Hmm. Would the U.S. be interested in invasion against Venezuela? Actually, okay, you're in the U.S. sphere. Huh. Actually, I'm going to see if I can try to invade Cuba. Just need to... Wait, you're in Sokoto sphere. What the... That is... Okay. Oh, wait, that's Spain. Hello. Ding dong. Uh, minimum wage. Let's just do it based on population, so I'm not fully like that. Let's do this. Okay. Let's just keep on moving. Well, anyways, um, yesterday I saw the Lego Batman movie. It was a pretty funny movie. Like, seriously, the first 15 minutes are awesome. Okay, uh, militancy or consciousness? Uh, consciousness, so I can hopefully get more that kind of stuff, because 
I don't know. If I can get more immigration, that'd be pretty cool. Honestly. Okay, blah, blah, blah. How about Siam? Who are you allied with? Huh. Do I want to, um, basically get the remaining pops in Siam? Wait, how about you, Diviet? How Ooh, okay, never mind. Never mind. Bad idea. Can I? Nope, can't declare war on satellite. Okay, so my option is Siam or Siam or um, Yemen. I could do Oman and take a piece of Kenya. Request military assets from Spain, sure. Okay, let's um, make sure I make even more money. Uh, oh, actually, I should have enough now to. Um, with the naval base in Hawaii. Or it might be in my best interest to... Actually, yeah, let's put the naval base in Hawaii. So, built. Okay, so when this gets to, I think, either 3% or somewhere along around there... Oh, hold on. Military access from Egypt. Sure. I'm not going to be fighting you yet because... Yeah. Anyways, um... Hmm. Form an alliance. They will not accept. Minus 159, base reluctance, infamy, and distance. And you're in other sphere of influence. Whatever. I'm still going to raise you because I have a bunch of diplomacy points that I can spend anywhere. I'll increase relations with you. And let me get to Japan. Let me increase relations with you. I should really increase relations with you because... Gotta hate. Oh, hello. I can do another one. Uh, universal. Social form desire. Sure. And, um, okay. Sweet. Sweet. Let me make this rise up a bit more. And let's see how many troops that I have here. Merge them together. And deadlines for military access. Sure. Everyone gets everything, okay? So, but that's raised to 200.6 first. Very nice. And a little bit more. There we go. And now, encourage soldiers in Hawaii. Major discovery. Nice, nice, nice. Could it make me more money? Always nice to make more money. Actually, when can I declare war on Ethiopia again? Huh. Hold on. Show wars. 1886, so five years. That should be enough time. Suffrage, lose one consciousness. Uh, I'd rather have them be uh, more conservative than reactionary because I want... Hmm. Maybe I should become reactionary. I don't know. Let's just stick with the liberal things. Maybe communists might pop up my country. <laughs> so you stand a But yeah, right now I'm just doing the whole waiting game till I um, infamy drops. Because then from there I can. Um, hmm. Yeah. Is the factory still producing stuff? Nice. Can I invest? Nope. I can't invest. Actually, I'm going to need some capitalists. And knights, I can recruit some. So I can actually afford a capitalist. Okay, let's build an army. Uh, Zanza, no, excuse me, infantry. Nice. One, two, boom. Okay, functional. Uh, polling mitigation. Or justification, demand, sufficiency. Reinforcements, regular experience, uh, Navy, Navy, uh, build time, supply range. Yeah, I guess let's look at this done, I guess. Naval organization. Even though, honestly, that's kind of a waste right now. Stockpile, let them keep their stuff. Yeah, let's work on some of the commerce tech. That would probably be a nice little boost here for a bit. Uh, this is going to take a while. 
this is going to take a while. Anyway, what Hawaiian communists? Yeah, I'm going to just not bother um, trying to suppress them. It will be actually kind of interesting to see what would happen. So yeah, um, I decided to get Hearts of Iron 3, because it's way cheaper to gain Hearts of Iron 4, and I'm going to see if I can try to do a mega campaign. I haven't really played um, Hearts of Iron, so it'll probably take me a couple of weeks, maybe a month or so, to get some experience out of it before I, you know, play Hearts of Iron. Anyways, bring you down here. Okay, it's the year eight it's the year of the Lord, eighteen eighty-two. Okay, let's bring you over here. Egypt is not allied with anyone. Cool. Okay. So now I have hmm, Polynesian soldiers from Hawaii. They still need to be reinforced. Actually, how much? What is my budget like right now? Okay, I could probably reduce tariffs down to maybe like here. Ah, Tutankhamun's tomb has been explored. Nice. Let's bring you up to fifty just to see what happens. Okay. Yeah, this. I'll be honest. This campaign um hasn't really been going in my favor. Because I screwed up a lot of things, honestly. I should have invested more in the Navy. I should have taken, um... Not Dili, uh, This place. Aloha. Or wherever, um, that independent country is. So I can take their nice, juicy population. And now I'm just suffering the consequences. Okay, uh... Sheesh. Okay, I might want to do it get, when it gets down to 17, um, I'm willing to make a gamble. And maybe try and get Hejaz, maybe? Oh, you're at war with Japan. Nice. What's Japan up to right now? Japan is at war with Persia? What the... F what, what's going on here? Accusation of Persian Afghanistan. Well... Well then, wait. Who was siding? Well then, Persia's gonna get their ass whooped. I would like to take advantage of that, but I don't think I'm strong enough to um, garner much of a resistance. Okay, we got we can build another troop of Mubasa. Awesome. Why am I losing money all of a sudden? Never mind. And. Let's wait for it to get down to 17. Woo! Rebellion. Hostiles. Who are you people? Who are you? Yeah, let's 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 let's, let's communism take over in Hawaii. I want I want a communist government in Hawaii, because that's I don't know. Diplomatic influence. Okay. That might actually come out to be... That might actually end up being handy. Let's see. I'm building artillery in uh, Mombasa. That's... Uh, where? Ah, oh, there it is. Okay, so let me just grab you. And let's head down to Mombasa. So we can make sure we get that. Nice, I'm making a little more money now. I guess I can't afford a bit... I guess I can't afford a bit on the Navy. Let's repay the loan of Germany. And in a few months, I guess I'll declare war on Hejaz. And holy crap, I can build another military unit. Okay, um, let's build another engineer. It's good. Uh, uh, uh. uh it's that in joke of a radio show I follow. Uh, I'm not gonna name names because I don't want them to say I'm a troll terrorist or anything. Okay, grab you and the put you in the boat. Come to you. Go over here. 
Okay, once it gets down to 17. Come on. Actually, I should probably change my government to a more of a conservative. Yeah, I got points. I got. I can spend points to suppress people. Pro military. There we go. Nice. Okay, Median. Median is where? By face when it's over here. Eh, where is Median? Oh well, we'll eventually find them. Uh, let's see. Uh, come on. Next month. Uh, should I sign the Geneva Convention? Uh, uh, no. That'd probably just be bad voodoo. Okay, it'll take 139 days. And we can require a maximum infamy of 10. Let's just bring that, bring that down to 17 and a half. Sure, Germany, you can enter in. Uh, non-socialist allowed. Universal voting, whatever. I'm gonna have a communist government in the end anyways. Decline. And uh, where is that, uh, second arm? Oh, nice. Nice. Oh, okay, I'm missing, okay, my other army is, um, where? Ah, sweet. Okay, we'll just keep one spare troop there just because. And let's see, next month. And boom. Okay. Okay, guys. If this doesn't work out so well, I'm going through a bad boy war. Establish protectorate. Proceed. War justification. It's going to be 139 days. Economy debate. Militancy. Kind of state capitalism. Whatever. I don't care at this point. Okay. Upper house has been rearranged. Nice. The double, double standard, not double. Cool, I got market regulations, plus 20%. Um, I guess... Machine guns. Yeah, let's do machine guns. How much longer till the communists take over Hawaii? Okay, diplomacy at peace. Okay, at this point, if I was to get an infamy hit, I should be in the safe zone. Secularization is fine. It's gonna take... Holy crap, there's a small chance I might be able to take them out without... Okay, this this is this is getting awesome. This is, holy crap. 1.2 infamy. That's, that's fine, that's negligible. Awesome. Okay, they're coming right for us. Nice. Okay, so let's... Declare, let's do the war on Yemen then. Okay, we're gonna do like that. Um, let's see how bad the. Ouch, this is gonna hurt. This is gonna hurt a lot. But let's see how much longer. Three, two, one, zero. Okay. Uh, are you allied with anyone? Declare war. Establish protectorate. I mean, 85 war score. Nice. I wonder, can I tr cross my... <laughs> oh, alright. They are going to get fucked. Actually, I might even need that high. I could probably get... I could probably get away of 60%. Quite honestly. And why am I back at being a monarchist? Um, crap, I just had an election, so I'm not allowed to change for, for a good year. Oh, well. Okay, who's lacking right now? Hawaii. Whatever. That's not really important to me right now. Boom. Okay, let's go up here. And the stock market. Okay. Once I acquire this. Okay, let's wipe out the military just to get them out of the way. I won. Nice. Let's bring you over here. I'm starting to realize maybe I should spare these armies so I can get these troops. Because... 
yeah, it could help with a military count right now because ouch, just getting bad. Okay, Mombasa. So, um, okay, I just lost my chance of expanding. I just lost my chance of expanding, and I don't want to do that because that might lead to bad voodoo. Actually, training capitalists because of Marxist revolutionary is actually counterintuitive now I just realized. Oh well. Anyways, how's the war going? 23%. Still getting a bit more. Getting repaid debts causes... Okay, Persia owes us money. Okay. That's cool. Cool, cool, cool. Shit, I'm losing troops quick. Okay, upper house has been arranged. Oh, sweet, I'm making money again. Hooray! Can I afford to go full on? Holy crap, I can't afford to go full on. Nice. Okay, acquire the capital. Let's see. Okay, just need to score a few more territories. All right, found the, found the oil in Brene. Remember that invasion of Brene in my first episode? It's now going to be worth it. I finally got oil. <laughs> nice, I got machine guns. Nice, nice, nice. Um, mm. Let's um, increase the research points. Since I'm not really doing much else. And now the, the communists have occupied Hawaii, so that means by the sometime within a month or so. Woohoo! So now we're communist. Chairman, our new affairs is in a standard. We are now the communist country of Hawaii. Ha Hawaiian communism wins. King, the Hawaiian communists have enforced their demands. No voting, ruling party owning, blah blah. Okay. Perform nationalization. Oh, the horror, no. I think we just became the first communist country in the game, I think. So, yeah. Um, the benefits of having a communist government in this game is, um... You can produce your own stuff, manufacture your own stuff. It just makes, um, building things... It just does makes things a lot more efficient and easier to do. So, let's see. Uh, budget, politics, uh, what was it? The budget? No. The trade? Population, production, nope. Factories. I can reopen the factory here and yeah. Anyways, um. Ah, oh, crap. The talent got this to jazz. Oh well. Let's keep on going. I'm gonna need one more. I'm gonna just need. Acquire one more territory. Japan found Tukutaman's tomb? Okay. That's interesting. Anyways, I wonder how much longer do I have before the video's over. Ooh. Okay, we got the machine gun armaments. Nice, nice. That means I can actually perform um, the colonization game now, even though it's not really worth it. And I just realized I forgot to press the start button for the countdown timer. So I uh, want to declare acquire Yemen. That's going to be it for me. Actually, can I declare peace on them now? Let's see. Propose peace. They will not accept this offer. Okay. Boom. Now we accept the offer. They would not accept this offer. Propose. They have rejected. Dude, you got fully annexed. What can you do now? Like, seriously, people. You got annexed. Propose peace. They will not accept this offer. Why? You lost. Let me annex you. They will not accept this offer. Oh. Uh. Trade union. Um. Let's see. Oh, the upper house says yes. Let's do, um. Basic school system. Are you seriously going to prevent... There we go. There we go. There we go. Okay. This is Christopher Smith signing off. And hello there, comrade.